Stabbed on some shit. Defending his bitch. He got stabbed. Damn. R.I.P. That's so soft. Video got Damn. What do you make of like uh, rappers that get popped in their own hometown? I know we done had like we just was saying Dex Osama, Nipsey, shit, fucking speaker not. There's so many niggas I can just go to name and people even from Houston. But what do y'all guys make of that? I think it's cool. Like you gotta get the fuck away. Yeah. Like, like you gotta get the fuck away. You can't be you can't be rapping all a lot, but, you know, you can't mm. be doing that. You can't do what you do normally. Right. You move different. You gotta move different. I feel that. What you like? I just, I just feel like. When she start getting that exposure, getting big, you know, you're gonna have haters around. Right. You gotta like separate separate yourself from all of that before crazy shit happen to you. I feel that. I ain't known a lot of cats, man, that mm. got big and then they come back to the hood like yeah. everything good and they get popular. I feel that. Man, give man, we up in here, we live on the back streets with your girl Cole, man. Got my homies here, we kicking shit, man. Let the streets know who y'all is, where y'all from, and what you got coming, if you don't mind. Yeah, it's GIMT, man. Loyalty Lifestyle uh, Corporation, man. We coming out of Ink Town, Eastern Michigan, man. 4841, you know. Uh, trying to make it out here in Houston, you know what I'm saying? Got my man Don right here, man. Don, some good shit, man. Yeah, I'm Don Drip, you know, from Ink Town, West Side, Detroit shit. It's out here in H Town, fucking with my man. You know, fuck with Bat Street. Hey! You know, yeah. No. Man, I appreciate y'all, man. I've been rocking with my homie since I met him, the homie Give, man, and I appreciate you for rocking. I appreciate you for, him, for bringing him too, man. But we're going to jump right up up into it, man. How did y'all get y'all started music? What was the first rap song that you heard that made you say, fuck it, I can do that? Take your time, you ain't got to rush down so we ain't live on our shit. I say, uh, I was listening to two. Talk to the camera, though. Keep talking to him. I was listening to Tupac as a kid. You know, watching music videos. I think the first song I heard from Tupac was um was um I get around. That's what started. That's why I started writing rap music. Even more Tupac and Big. Yeah, I got too many, man. Mo Murder. I mean, Bone Thugs and Harmony. Thugs and Thug, Thug, Ball. I mean, but when I heard, you know. Real motherfucking G's, I figured out I was gonna. Well, I could, by easy. Yeah, I knew I could do it. Bro, it was big, was big yeah. G's. I seen them. Bro, man. They talking that real shit. I said, I gotta do this. Man, I gotta play some easy E, man. I gotta do this. Man, y'all was yeah, getting. True. Man, a legend. Another person that died, unfortunately, career was short. He was on his way. Well, he was a legend. He was on his way to become bigger than, you know, HIV or whatever the case took him out, man. So, RIP to Easy E, man. Y'all from, let the streets know, man. I don't want to give too much, man. Let the streets know where y'all from. Easy Town. Easy Town. 4841 Bound. You know, okay. Compton. What up, though? Okay. Come on, Gardens. Pierce, what's going on? Okay. Area code for people that don't know who watching right now. 4841. Okay. 413. Seven, three, four. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, man, Carlisle, the Ave, Yale Block, Ten Block. We high. Yeah. Okay. High block. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I feel that, man. Michigan, by the way, of Ink Town, right? Inkston. 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 I don't want to fuck it up like Pink. Like Pinkston? No, so like Ink, like Ink. Uh huh. Stir. Inkster. Oh, okay, my country ass. Inkster. Yeah. I'm sorry about Marvelous that. Okay. Marvelous. 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 I ain't gonna say Houston niggas don't talk about what they be doing because I mean we don't know how they move. But right. It's believable. But our credibility is there because the shit is already in the raps, you know? Mm. Ain't no props and shit in that. It's mm. straight mm. gutter music, man. Straight shit. We ain't lying about none of that. Okay. Even if we ain't did it, nigga, we did it before. You feel me? I even feel that. Even, even if we ain't did it right now, we did it before. I feel that. So, I feel that, man. Do you guys feel, man, that you guys been rapping quite some time? Is it hard as an artist from the Midwest to pop? Knowing what y'all know and knowing that y'all know artists from y'all hometown, is it hard? Yeah. Yeah, it's, i say it's hard. It's hard for sure. Especially if it's like, you think it would be different, you know, if you come to a different city, it's a different sound that nobody heard, you know what I'm saying? But 
a lot of this shit, you know, Detroit has this, you know, fucking like epitome that everybody think everybody's supposed to spit like Eminem or okay. spit like T. Green. We better go into that. Keep going. And we don't, you know what I'm saying? We don't. Niggas rap different. We rap about different types of shit, but I mean, it's just different upbringing. We all, you know, mm -hmm. we just have our own brand. We did it from everybody. Okay. Yeah. To go on to get what Gif was saying about we think because I'm gonna say we because I'm a part of the outside world because I'm not from there but I do I am a fan of the music don't get me wrong because I'm an Eminem head I love Grizzly why do you think people feel like everybody sound like an Eminem everybody gonna sound like Sean everybody gonna sound like Grizzly because that's the ones that popped off so mm. everybody gets that so how did they pop how, was it hard for them as far as what do you guys know I, well for Sean nah. He was already different coming out. I mean, I give you Kanye, that. Kanye had already fucking close. I give you that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but yeah. there's there's other niggas too. Danny Brown from Detroit. Niggas, yeah, different Danny man. So different. Danny Brown, no teeth, getting his dick sucked off state. Man, Greenhouse, he, yes. He's different, you know. So it's niggas that's different out there. But then you got niggas that's all trying to do the same shit too, sort of. You know what you mean? So like you got you know the scam niggas. You got. Uh, you know, All Star, Jr., T. Grizzly. You know, they all sound similar, mm. so the music sound good. Okay. PZ sound a little different as well. So it's just niggas trying to sound the same shit sometimes. I feel you it. Know? What are y'all bringing different that we ain't heard? Come we're on in, fellas. We're bringing that Ink Town shit, man. Ink Town is a different side nobody's ever seen. Right. When I get done. When I get done spitting, I'm gonna show you. Yeah, when I get done spitting, man, y'all gonna know where I'm from. Okay. You gonna Google my shit. You gonna Google what the fuck is Insta? What is that? I feel what like. What's 4841 mean? What, you know what I'm saying? What shit mean? What okay. street names is? What hood is it from? I you feel like, like how, you know, how, you know, LA, you know, you got Compton out there. Mm. I ain't never Beach. been to California in my life. Right. Right. That's how I'm from Compton. You know what I'm mm. saying? I ain't never been to LA in my life. I'm mm. from Compton. I feel like any advice that you can give artists in the city that's from another city that's relocated? Link up with everybody you can, man. That's just a fact. You gotta link up with everybody you can, man. You never know who watching, who can put you on, who can put you in a position, who can put you on a different type of versatility, bro. You just gotta be versatile, man. And that's me. You know what I'm saying? I'm linking up with anybody and everybody, man. I ain't charging nobody no features, fees, none of that. Cause I know my work, but then I know what I can bring to the table. Right. Even if your shit trash, I'm still gonna make that bitch pop. Feel that Five shit. Motherfucking verse is just ridiculous. Y'all know so like when you know with the right people, you get your connections. Mm -hmm. You know, put some work together, and that uh, you start moving. Mm -hmm. I'm willing to work with anybody. You know, it don't matter where you from. I feel that. It's all about you know, we all want to get rich and. Get big and make it to the top. Man, go. So, man, go. I feel like, how did you guys uh, get y'all name? Me, I got mine from the block, man. I was I was in Atlanta actually when I got oh, my name. Okay. Uh, we was outside chilling and shit in high school. They was rapping and shit. They was like, man, let me go right there, man. They gifted with the words, man. So I kept I like that name. That. Okay. And then I just kind of kept it. I kept it. I was YG at that time. I was just YG because I was young, you know. But then when I got to Houston, uh, I was actually in Tyler, Texas, matter of fact. Um, shout out uh, Lambo Black, man. He and this dude uh, named Black as well. Mm -hmm. They gave me the name Young Gil. They kept Gil. And I was like, yeah, man, old head called me that before. So I kind of just kept it. Mm. So I got a little older and I just dropped the young eyes just recently because, you know, shit, nigga, old, I can't be young forever. Man, JC's like, 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 you can't be young forever. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> I, he say gotta, or not? Yeah, you gotta drop it, man. Okay. Like, just like Romeo dropped a little, just like Bow Wow dropped a little. You, gotta you drop eventually it. gotta drop it. What about you? Dude, I was, I had different names. I was Lil Don. I was Don D. You know, just everybody's called me Don D. Mm. From high school. And mm. My family members they just called me Don Don because my daddy, my daddy, they his little name Don. So they just called me Lil Don Don. Mm. Big Don Don. Mm. So I had different nicknames, but I ended up just changing it to, you know, Don Drip. One of my people, they called me Don Trip one time. Mm. I was like, you know what? The nigga kind of Don Trip. Look, okay. <laughs> if you take the buffs off and you see Don Trip and put a picture of that nigga, they look the fucking same. I feel it. Without the beard, though. I yeah. feel that, man. Y'all in here, Cartier, I man, stunner eye with the, the glasses looking all dip and that shit, man. What 2020 looking like for you guys? Oh, man, it's gonna be some big shit, man. Loyalty lifestyle is gonna really pop off, man. Yeah, okay, talk about some... the brand, let the streets know, man. Yeah, man, we got my man that came home, man. My nigga Ken, man. Shout out Solid Ken, man. Shout out Ken. He 
got a con. So once he get off the books, man, he he down in Houston. We getting in there. Okay. So tape, tape next, man. Tape coming soon. Uh, we gonna drop some shit for him, man. Just let them know how we do things out mm. here. So, you okay. Got, you got a lot of niggas from back at home. We trying to bring you down in Houston and get this movement popping. Mm. Putting on for everybody. Has Houston been uh, very receptive to you guys as far as the music? Have y'all been receiving the love or the exposure that you guys been wanting? Yeah, so far, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was popped off. Uh, it, it popped off dead and I thought it would, you know what I'm saying? Because it was different for me. You right. know what I'm saying? It was more so a different. Uh, style for me it right. was a little slower it was more houston based type so i kind of felt like i owe that to houston you know what i'm saying mm. i'm from here you feel me so i respect I, I, that i'm not from here so i gotta show where i'm at now mm. i live here my kids here you know what i'm saying i work here you know what i'm saying the house here i gotta show love to houston that's my mm. homage to them mm. you know what i'm saying even when my man slim even chopped that hoe up it made me find better because the culture here is different than anywhere else man for mm. sure we knew about Houston man back in what? What's that? 20, yeah, two, 2003? Right. Till, yeah, still tipping. Yeah, yeah, still okay. tipping. We was, we was on that shit, man. I was banging Mike Jones every day. Yeah, I was really like Mike Jones, Jones man, yeah. man, I, I knew about that Houston shit. Okay. Yeah, we we very different. That's what make a lot of people gravitate towards that shit, which I really respect, man. But shit, before we get out of here, man, plug the IGs, man. Let them know where they can find the music, the brand, and everything, please, if y'all don't mind. Yeah, so it's gonna be Y U N G underscore G I F T L L C. That's all platforms, man. Got some shit coming soon, man. Distro kid got me looking right. So come in. It's gonna be smooth. Crazy. I mean, plug the IG. Don Drip, 313, D-O-N, D-R-I-P, 313, Don Drip. That's Instagram, Snapchat, Polo Don, 313, P-O-L-O-D-A, D-O-N, 313 for Snapchat. Facebook, you can find me as Don Drip. Everything. Everything. What's next? Yeah, we got paid in full.